from Switzerland, Verbier local. And if you grew up in Verbier riding, you know how to deal with such terrain. That's right, she's a playful rider as well, hitting that same top here as a lot of the snowboard guys and some of the snowboard girls did. Uh, putting a little bit of a shifty into it. Also lining up the second air, the same as Ari. So quite a similar run to Ari so far, but uh, if you wants to do a big cliff and throw a big 360 down the bottom, that could, you know, get her into first place. But hitting Jonathan Penfield's air and taking it deep and stomping it. Oh, oh my yes. gosh. We have another great run over on our hands, I tell you that. Yeah. Side hitting off that, stopping it too, finding the transition. The transition is the right angle landing for your takeoff, and that's exactly what you're doing during your line scoping. Stomping that one too, finding the right transition on that one as well. The line scoping is what enables you to keep your fluidity up because you know what's coming next, and it looks like Elizabeth's done that really well. Coming into the blind section now, so hard to not be hesitant coming into here. Where's my feature? Where's my feature? There it is. Oh, everyone else went slow off it. Why did they do that? I'll take a different angle and I'll stomp it. Little bit back seat, but I don't think it's going to hurt her score too much. Side hitting off the bottom air. Well, I think her top section was stronger than her bottom section there, McFly. It was, it was, and uh, it was a solid run. It's going to be a good score, but as we had already four amazing lines thrown down, it's going to be tough even for a strong score to end up at the very top. Judges so, like it though, all up in green. This air definitely was her highlight. Blind, straight, no hesitation, and super well executed.